Hey guys, it's Jag. Welcome back to the arcade. Let's get back to just another game. Fire Emblem Three Houses. Last episode, we finally explored the monastery for the first time in five years. We caught up with a bunch of our students. We listened to their concerns. Some of them, um, well, most of them are not exactly thrilled with the upcoming war that they're in. But quite a number of them are expressing doubt in themselves, which is something as their professor we're gonna have to handle. And that means more classes? Let's end today's free time and find out. No, if there are classes, it's not this month. We have a mission right away. All right, well, let's get to it then. Uh, let's go to the marketplace. Do I need to refresh any battalions? Apparently not. Let's check their inventory. Ah, right, that button. Uh, let's make sure everyone's got a decent weapon, mostly. Of course, I'm fine. In fact, I could put... I might keep that chest key. Might be a good idea. Hubert, you're using magic. You're not an issue. Lindhart, same, but you have a sword. Bernadetta, your silver bow's fine. Your silver sword's fine. Is all their stuff topped up at is my sword yeah all our weapons have been fully replenished well that's handy so we don't need to worry about it then how considerate of the video game then let's just go to our mission the great bridge coup the black eagle strike force has an unexpected encounter with someone thought to have died years prior amidst the joy your forces prepare to invade alliance territory Ooh, that sounds, uh, very intriguing. Let's deploy. Uh, no, I'm not gonna save. We just started. The newly crowned king of the Holy Kingdom of Fargus, Dimitri, has declared fealty to the Church of Seros and is raising an army in preparation for all-out war with the Empire. As leader of the Alliance, Claude maintains a facade of neutrality amidst infighting between those who support and those who oppose the Empire. Meanwhile, the Black Eagle Strike Force plans to capture Alliance territory before Edelgard takes the war to the Kingdom and the Church of Seros. With sights set on capturing Deirdre at the center of House Regan's territory, she leads a march across the Great Bridge of Murden to establish a bridgehead. Interesting. I like these new cinematics. These are really cool. The Great Bridge Coup, Crimson Flower Chapter 13, Beyond Escape. We're about to commence our attack on the Great Bridge of Murden. <clears throat> but first, allow me a moment of your time. Sure. You you seem to be smiling just slightly more than you used to. What do you need? It is something that I can only ask of you. Listen well. It concerns Lady Edelgard's uncle, the regent of the Empire, Lord Arundel. Although he is currently cooperating with Her Majesty, he maintains his own sizable military troops. It seems to me that his plans differ from our own. Isn't House Arundel... Wasn't that the one where, um... Geralt... Uh, not Geralt. Um... Death Knight boy, um, Yuritsa. Was it the one he was from? I assume you recall a certain group scheming from five years ago? Solon and Kranya. They both served Lord Arundel. Ah. Why must we cooperate or he must be dealt with? Um, I believe we've been asked to deal with him. Professor. I understand how you must be feeling, considering what they did to your father. I know it must be foul to even consider cooperating with their kind. I 
gotta admit, I like this new Hubert. I really do. However, their power is essential for us at present. Edelgard also strongly opposed the idea at first. Our enemy is the Church of Seros itself. It cannot be toppled with the Empire's might alone. Those working under Lord Arendel are extremely hostile toward the Church. And the enemy of our enemy is... Well, I think you sufficiently understand by now. We can see his right eye! Holy crap, you guys! Is this the first time in the, in the game we've seen his eye? Well, that's exciting right there. Are you sure that's a good idea? Until all of Fodlan is united, it is a necessary evil. I guess you kind of barely deal with him afterward. Time will tell. I guess you can kind of barely see it, right? Just barely. But holy crap, that's the first time we've ever actually fully, well, somewhat seen it. Regardless, Her Majesty and I wish to join our power with yours. You should know that in her heart, Her Majesty regards that group as enemies of herself and her family. They used her father, the former Emperor, as a puppet, and murdered her siblings with their vile experimentation. Ah, I see. Well, I guess we kind of did have hints about that. I believe Her Majesty may have told you some of this herself. That is why this was a very painful decision for her to make. I will do all I can to ensure her suffering is not in vain. And I hope I can count on you to do the same. As for all I have told you, please keep it in mind as we march forward. More importantly, I implore you to fight as best you can for Edelgard. From the bottom of my heart, I beg this of you. You know, I have to ask, Hubert does everything he can to keep Edelgard from suffering, and that means he probably takes on a bunch of tasks that he knows her conscience wouldn't allow her to do. Does anybody tend to his suffering? You know, he seems like an honorable guy. He seems creepy as hell, but he seems honorable and, you know, he wants to do the right thing just in his own way. You know, that can't be easy on him either. Maybe some of this is finally coming out. Let's, especially since he trusts us at this point. Like, we passed the muster of his trust. He probably likes us a lot. All right, let's look at the map. What we got? Some uh, Cavaliers, it looks like. I'm just gonna kind of use that for mounted units. Um, an armor knight, is that a... That's just an armored one, not a fortress, right? No, it's a fortress. Yeah, those are specifically cavaliers. That's what I figured since they were carrying a lance. Fortress knight. A brawler of some sort. A grappler. Huh. We have not fought too many bare-handed enemies. That'll be interesting. Some archers, probably snipers. No, just archers. I'm not very good at reading, like the sprites. I'm not gonna lie. Um, some things that are being dropped. What's this? Oop. A hexlock shield. A shield offering strong protection and resilience. Yeah, it does. Ooh, that's gonna be cool. And a brave bow. Oh my god. Oh, that's a nuts. I didn't notice that at first, that's like nuts! Also, the wielder of this bow is emboldened and will attack twice when initiating combat. He's their sniper. Who is- this is, uh, uh, I did not notice. Judith. I don't think she was in his house. She might be a general? I don't remember her. Oh, a nuts. Oh, man. Just regular soldiers? Ah, then we did want to bring a chest key. Good thing I'd kept that. Uh, in fact, our forces appear to be split up. I can't move me. 
That's a shame. How many units do we have on the field? Probably 10 as standard. There's 7 there. 10 or 11? Yeah, we got 11. Okay. Um, What tile is this? A heal tile. Okay. So let's do this. First off, I want to adjust items. Since I can't move me, let's... Let's give this chest key to someone up there. Uh, let's see. Uh, Petra, you take it. There. That also frees up a spot. Hmm, I'm gonna keep that Leaven Sword. I'm gonna keep everything there. Do I need to free up more inventory space for anybody? Hubert, why do you still have this rusted bow? Go ahead and uh, put, store that in the, in the uh, convoy. Ferdinand, you do not need that hammer. I don't even know why I gave it to you. Bernadetta, you're okay. Edelgard, you have a relic. Let's take a look at that. A crest stone weapon designed to Edelgard's specifications, allowing her to use Raging Storm. Ooh. Ferdinand, you're okay. Bernadetta, you're okay. Dorothea, you're fine. Sylvain. You're probably not gonna fight a monster here, so let's store the Blessed Lance and... We're not going to fight anyone with, with poison, so let's store the, the uh, antitoxin. In fact, someone else had an antitoxin, then they, yeah. You can store that. We're not fighting any venom weapons that I saw. Go, got, there. If we do fight venom weapons, I'm pretty sure we have recovery magic that will handle it. Uh, yeah, it should be good. Okay, Manuela and Mercedes are both equipped as adjutants. I think I'm going to be... You know, I kind of feel bad because I wanted to pull a Mercedes in, but my core class is so useful. Yeah, I guess we'll leave them as adjutants because... Hmm... Yeah, I think Linhart can use recovery magic and, and clear any status effects we might run into. Um, let's look at the map again now that I got that situated. Let's adjust my front lines. I'm gonna. I can't adjust me. Bernadetta, why are you in the front? You come over here, young lady. You you get back there where you belong. Uh, actually, I'm pretty good with that unit up there. I like that. Yeah, this will work. Fight! Let's begin! Begin the battle! Victory conditions, defeat the enemy conditions, defeat conditions, by Leather Edelgard falls in battle, as always. We'll be capturing the Great Bridge of Murden, a key strategic location of the Leicester Alliance. Claude will surely be sending reinforcements, so we must prevail before they arrive. Our opponent is Judith, the so-called hero of Daphnal. Okay, so she is new. We can handle her, so long as we don't get careless. The boy said to run if I was in danger, but... I could never do that. I'll hold out until reinforcements arrive. Well, your funeral. Okay, so first off, let's move this unit I will forward. Prepare. Oh, you got... You got a nice little stance there. I like that. Let's take a look at our threat. We're not, this unit is not threat, so we can move forward pretty safely. Wait. I'm What's gonna have plan? you kind of guard the rear here. Let's make this quick. You come here. More fighting. Yeah, I'm sorry. Wow, that's. That was kind of a sad, a sad thing. We can only use Meteor once. What is its range? 
Uh, huge. Well, the fact that we can only use it once, I'm okay with the fact, I mean, that we might not have been able to save that girl from Thunder Catherine anyway. Uh, yeah, we'll wait here. Is it just me or is it more clear that people have moved? Like, they are monochrome. That feels new. Or at least more distinct. All right. Ready for anything. All of these guys sound so seasoned. I do this for all of us. I like this. I like this a lot. <laughs> Damn it. I don't like that. It is kind of a little bit depressing the that Empire. the mission levels have caught up with us. Put me in there. Yeah. <laughs> Not the brass. I'll put me in there. But put me in there. I got a job to do. All right. Death. What does this do? Intermediate dark magic has a high crit rate versus defense minus one. We'll, we'll launch defense. It's going to kill him anyway. Hardly worth the effort. All right. You're going to have to step up because they're both coming. Oh, Lord, they're coming. Um... I'm awake. <laughs> 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 you have all these. I will not back down one step. Oh. This Damn. Is the cost of war. Are you using your relic? I probably did not. Yeah, you are. I love how we have all these stoic expressions and then Linhart's just, I'm awake. <sighs> Damn it. Uh, let's see, you're probably gonna use my combat heart to finish things off here. Here we go. Your head. Or not. Yeah. Crit'll work. Big win. <laughs> Big win! Alright, now... All my soldiers, my not strategy? just... Not just my students, my soldiers. We're all comrades now. Alright, so maybe archery in general is not the best thing to attack a cavalier with. They just might be too nimble. Uh, disturbance. Ouch. I kind of want you to put that spear away. <laughs> I didn't realize you were equipped with the spear of assault. Alright, player phase. How am I wanting to do this? Uh, let's, um. Uh, let's use Nosferatu against the big guy. Magic's the best weapon here. Allow me to demonstrate. I must lead them well. I also must look cute as hell doing it. Yeah, he can only move one step. I think, Linhart, you're going to come in here and heal him. Actually, can you... 
You restore him. Yeah, you can. That does take that away. Cool. No, I don't want to go there. I'm going to do it from here. Dangerous, but worth it. Maybe not as dangerous as I was afraid it's going to be. Who's next? Get in line. <laughs> There's some of the old brush having fun cast bar I missed. Archer versus Archer? Nope. Bernie, we have to do something about your accuracy. That's okay. Armored Lord is on it. Let's see what a, a mirror it looks like. Interesting. I do not tolerate obstacles. Kind of creepy. All right, Fernand, you come up and take out this guy. Should be easy. Also, I need to unequip that relic. Keep forgetting about that, which means I'm gonna use it for at least one more turn. No, I can move over here and wait. All right, that's it for that unit, isn't it? No, he... Yeah, that's it. All right. I didn't remember moving Hubert, but I guess I did. All right, come on over here and open the chest. I got a Psycon. Is that the only chest on the map? Nope, there's another one. Oh, we... I did not get a chest key out of inventory. I didn't see it. That's a shame. That's a damn shame. Oh, there's another brawler there. Okay. You come up and back her up. Fernet or Sylvain, you wait there. Dorothea, you fill in the gaps here. That should do it. Actually, there is someone who can still go. Who? Oh! <laughs> okay, it's gonna be hard to tell with Hubert because he is... monochrome by default. Okay. I'll have to be clever. Oh man, they're getting mad. Assassin versus Brawler. Two speed classes, but mine's My better. Burns with pride. Skill level up. Authority is now D+. Learn Learn the ability. For the next Authority level 2. Ah, reinforcements. Judith! I'm so glad you're safe. Claude sent me here with reinforcements. Leonie! Wow, you look kind of cute. I have to put up with orders from that false leader. You're new. I don't recognize you. Because you're from the smallest noble house in all the Alliance, you whiner. <laughs> she doesn't take no shit. Enemy reinforcements. We didn't finish in time. Don't let them secure the ballista. I mean, it's literally the second turn, Edelgard. Alright, so this is actually a ballista tile. It sure is. Okay. Kind of in a bad position here. Hmm, what's the best way to handle this? You're going after... After Bernie. You're going after her. Actually, several people are going after her.
Hmm. All right, I'm gonna have to use you here. Steel lance. You should be able to finish him off easily. Help if you can dodge. Good. And he's down. I was just stronger. Let's have you stand here and wait. You're still going after after her. Both of you are going after my mage girl. Hmm. I think the best strategy might be to dance here and have you take out one of those archers. By the way, uh, I believe You're a big help that Dorothea's dancer's uniform is actually her songstress uniform, her original one from when she was in the opera. I believe that's an Easter egg. You're still going after Bernie. I don't appreciate that, but I will tolerate it. Gonna need you to move. Yeah! Burn until we meet again. Level 33. Nice improvement. nice improvement. I'm gonna still stand in your way here. Hmm. I'll have you come stand up here. And that actually cuts off the threat to you. So that's good for now. Why don't you finish off this guy, Caspar, and then I'm going to have you retreat to heal. Might makes right. <laughs> He's not even questioning it anymore. No time for accolades. It's just a statement of fact. All right, you can run over here and heal on him. Thanks for helping. I'm gonna have you right up here. Bernie, you're gonna take a step back right here. That gets everybody out of threat. I'm gonna need to start thinking about how to organize my forces. Hmm. I think Edelgard's gonna keep leading us forward here. What was that? Must be one of her abilities. Uh, I'm gonna have you. S hmm. This is great against you. All right, let's try it. Doesn't matter who you are. I won't hold back, and I won't fall to the Empire. Sorry, Leone. Judith, I'm sorry. I leave the rest to you. That's our first uh, comrade kill, and I really liked Leone. Yeah, we're not celebrating that one. Leone, you had such a full life ahead of you. I wish I could take your place. There's no reason I should die in this place. It's time for me to return home. You prick. This is it. Claude, I'm sorry. I couldn't defend the bridge. All who are able, retreat! Don't let her escape. If we can take her out now, the Daphnil territory will be ours. That will allow us to march safely through the Alliance. 
Defeat conditions. Byleth or Edelgard falls in battle or the enemy commander reaches the target destination. Alright. Unfortunately for... For my friend Ignatz there, I kind of want that brave bow. It might be hard to get. What? If only I'd live. Just All right. Well, I guess we're taking that back. All right. Um Let's consider this entire turn again now that I know that's going to happen. Uh from the point that I restored HP to Caspar. Ready for anything. Let's go ahead and move in a position where I can cut off some retreat. What's my strategy? We're gonna have to move quickly here. Fortunately, Edelgard can actually move pretty quick too. Despite being an armored lord, you're gonna still. You're going to move up here. Okay. Let's make this quick. Um This might be a bit deadly of a turn. What do we got here? I might have made a mistake here. He'll be fine with that. You're not moving. He'll be fine. He'll be fine. Alright, I think we're good with this. Doesn't matter who you are. I won't hold back. Alright, well she lived more than one turn. I have a feeling this is not going to be as impactful the second time. I am helping Claude build the future of Fodlin. Ignatz? Well... Actually, I forgot about the Brave Bow. Yeah, I screwed up. I screwed that up. I forgot about the Brave Bow. This is our chance. We'll just fast forward to a point when I can actually do this properly. Alright, so here's what we're going to do. I've got 11 charges on Divine Pulse, holy crap. Uh, I'm taking back that Ferdinand moved. All the way back here. We're gonna... We're gonna move Bernie Don't forward. Do this for all of us. I'm gonna What's step forward strategy? and see who comes up. I should be okay. Ready for anything. I'm gonna move you forward. That brave bow is potentially dangerous. Yeah, all right, let's try this. Doesn't matter who you are. Redhead versus redhead. We can't place the future of Fodlin in Edelgard's hands. He actually looks upset about fighting me. If you're allied with the Empire, I have no choice but to fight you. I am making bad decisions here. So th that brave bow. I have been defeated. Yeah, it's a fine pulse. 
That brave bow is very deadly. Actually, I want to go back even further than that to when Bernadetta moved. I'm going to have to wait. I'm going to have to wait and see how everybody moves. That's just going to be how it has to happen. I cannot let Ignatz initiate battle. Is Let's there anything you can do? Up. No. You do not have Meteor, which is too bad because that could be very useful. Alright. Let's just let them have their turn. We've... Oop, no. We've done what we could. Doesn't matter who you are. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm starting to feel less sympathetic towards you. <laughs> nice spin. She's a dancer. She gets the moves. Hmm. I did not learn a whole lot from that. I will prevail. However, you did move yourself in line of sight of me. Hmm. Not that that's doing me any good. All right, let's retreat here then. Let's have you come up and attack here. Yeah. You're all Captain Gerald's enemies, and I will avenge him here. Mm, the problem I'm sorry. is everybody's going to retreat, and I kind of wanted to put myself in a better position before that happened. Leone, there's no right. reason. You're gonna abandon, you're gone. What's the plan? You're gonna come up here, attack this guy, knock him out, and I'm gonna have you move again. <laughs> or this girl. That is. That's it. Simple plan. Simple plans are the best. Alright. Dance more for fighting. me. Yeah, more fighting. I owe you one. Push comes the shove. I will try to nuke. Um, try to nuke Ignatz from orbit. But now I've got a, a very mobile unit on the way, so that's a plus for me. Ready they for should anything. start retreating very quickly here. Move towards the top. Hmm. I do this for all of us. Bernie, I like the new you. I really do. In. I'm gonna have to take a rest here. You're coming up here. Caspar, you're coming up. Put me in there. We're gonna try to dodge Ignatz as much as we can. What's my strategy? I don't know, to be honest with you. I'm hoping that they basically For just the Empire. straight retreat here. Taking baby steps until I can be sure. I've cut a bloody path. This is it. Claude, I'm sorry. I couldn't defend the bridge. All who are able, retreat. Alright. Don't let her escape. 
If we that will allow. Me. All right, there's our new conditions. She's retreating. All right. Ignatz did not engage or uh, begin battle. That's actually good. Because that bravery bow only works if he initiates combat. <laughs> Goodbye. You I had your chance. I mean, you you also think it's fun. That's a win for everyone. Good. This is like the worst move you could have made, dude. Ah, oh, you're kind of still in my way, but that'll change. All right. You're gonna move forward. Oop. You're gonna move forward and attack. Yeah, just fire. That's plenty. I'm gonna need you to hurry over here and then I'm gonna have you dance again when I get a moment actually should I have you heal it's also a possibility big nuts I'm afraid it's time to die my friend I want that bow and I don't want you to get away I am helping Claude build the future of Bodlin. Sorry. I should have known this would happen. I'll use it in your memory. Ignatz, damn it! Such a good kid. He died too young. Well, if that did anything, it probably pissed them off. You're going for her, you're going for me. You're going for me, you're not going to do much damage. You're also going for me. Let's give you guys another option. Um, kind of going to move everybody to this corner here. And I think I am actually going to heal. Because she really needs it. We'll have some girl time. Okay. Linhart. Or no, that's... Never mind. Linhart, uh... Should I have you physic? I actually forgot that... Well, physic wasn't going to reach him anyway. Uh... No. Not really going to be helpful. You're retreating. You're retreating. You've made a bad choice in life. I'm not going down. Battered up. Who's next? Get in line. <laughs> All right, he's out. Okay, I'm gonna need the Cavaliers to cut off your escape here.
Hmm, how did... I need to clear the path for him, too. Alright, Edelgard, that's gonna be your job. No, don't use your relic. Use your steel axe. Good enough. I love that Edelgard's carrying this big, piss-off shield. I'm not at my best today. That's okay. Alright, you've got an 86% chance to hit this guy with Deadeye. And you did it. Pretty good, huh? Ah, cute little butt shot. Alright, that will help quite a bit. Hubert, you're gonna, hmm, I guess you're just gonna crowd in here. Who are you going after? Linhart, good for you. Good luck with that. Alright, with that path cleared, I think this is a safe move. forward can I move her? I can basically move her to where Lysithia is now. Let's move Lysithia. Move you here. No. I move you prepare. first. Now move you in behind her and you can dance. She moves again. Right here. Caspar, why don't you take out this threat to Lysithia? That's a good finish. Attack at your own risk. Just like that. Flawless plan. Miss flawless. All right, are they all, are they all going to retreat? Looks like it. You're on your own. Yeah, it's probably worth it. Goodbye. Uh, it looks like I'm done for. Claude, I'm sorry. I sense an improvement. <laughs> Mastered skills for Paladin. I need to put this to use. Learn the ability Aegis. For Aegis. And we got the Hexlock shield. Alliance soldiers, Judith has fallen. Further conflict is futile. If you surrender, your lives will be spared. Lay down your weapons immediately. Stage complete. The Great Bridge coup turns seven. Not what I would call flawless, but Caspar was our MVP. And his motivation is maxed out. Yeah, that was rough. That was really rough. All right, we'll save here. That bravery bow just wow. I got to put that on on uh Bernie right away. You have all fought well. With this victory, we now have a foothold in the alliance. The Imperial army will cross the Aramid River and push the front lines forward. The fight will continue. 
But do not allow that to stop you from taking pride in our hard-won victory. Ah, this should put a stop to one of Edelgard's choice phrases. Well done, Professor. <laughs> I believe it was, if only the Professor were here, we could forge ahead and change the tides of this war. <laughs> All we were missed. Ferdinand, it is not necessary to tell the Professor such things. <laughs> We're not the only ones benefiting. The whole Imperial Army is stronger now. Yes, it seems the Empire finally has both of its legs to stand on. Don't you agree? You make it sound as though I can't run the Empire on my own. Perhaps it's more apt to say that the Pegasus has recovered its home. Judith of Daphne. What a magnificent warrior. I'm happy to have the Professor back just like old times, but... I don't think I'll ever get used to this cruel exchange of lives. When there is something you must not be conceding, you must keep fighting. The fighting has been continuing for five years, but now I am again witnessing the Professor's power. I hate fighting, but with the Professor here, maybe it's slightly less terrible? Just a little. Oh, but everyone is working so hard! Stop it, Bernie. You can't be the only one complaining. Now that's a big change. She's... She's matured. I'm glad to see everyone so inspired. It seems the reappearance of the Professor has done much to raise your morale. Do you not feel the same, Hubert? Come now, be honest with yourself. <laughs> now, we must take advantage of the situation and blaze ahead. Our path is still a long way. Alright, we'll just save in the same slot. Part 2. Crimson Flower. Guardian Moon. The Master Tactician. Having crushed the Alliance's army and captured the Great Bridge of Murden, the Imperial Army prepares to attack Deirdre, the Alliance's base of operations. Come on, loading screen. You're making a you're making a mockery of me. I was I thought you were going to be quick. Ah, oh, there we go. We will have lessons. I figured we would. Professor, what is your opinion of Claude? I can't help but wonder what sort of impression he made on you. Hmm. He's a schemer. He's a jokester. He would be a good king. I think he's a schemer. That is inarguable, and his schemes are still going strong. With them, he's managed to keep the Leicester Alliance from the Empire's grasp. How has he done that? Since the beginning, territories within the Alliance have been split between those who support the Empire and those who oppose it. Claude has been acting as an intermediary between the two, essentially keeping the Alliance pacified. As both sides are of equal strength, he's created a situation in which they've all agreed to avoid fighting each other and causing undue bloodshed. By carrying on as though the Alliance is united, he's minimized the Empire's influence there. <laughs> it's quite impressive how well his bold scheme has worked out. However, he is walking on thin ice. One wrong move and the Alliance will shatter. Speaking of Claude, Your Majesty, we should not delay in our invasion of the Alliance. It would seem that Claude has some fresh scheme up his sleeve, to no one's surprise. Is that so? Yes. 
The people of Deirdru have suddenly found it difficult to leave or enter the city. We can safely assume he is preparing for battle, but I am certain his plans extend beyond that as well. Do you not think we should take Deirdru at once? Deirdru, the aquatic capital. A city floating on the ocean certainly poses a challenge. Since it's deep within Regan territory, we haven't had the opportunity to attack it directly. However, now that we have control of the Great Bridge of Murden, our situation has changed drastically. They can no longer expand their supply line into the Empire, and so we can finally attack Regan territory. House Regan is not only Claude's house, but also the flagship of those who oppose the Empire within the Alliance. If House Regan falls, the other Alliance Lords will be tripping over themselves to join us. That is why we cannot fail to take Deirdre. Let's go! That seems difficult. That seems difficult. Fair enough. Claude will certainly be a difficult opponent. The leader of the Alliance has had many things said about him. They say he is unbeatable in a battle of intellect. I hear they call him the Master Tactician. Well. I was hoping they called me the Master Tactician, but apparently not. Regardless, we have to prepare, and we will begin that next episode. I'll see you guys then. Thanks for coming out and joining me today. I always appreciate that. If you enjoyed what you saw, make sure you let me know by giving me that thumbs up. Subscribe if you want to see more, and leave me comments. I love reading comments. Anyways, thanks for watching again, and you guys have a great day. Later.